I'm Dr. Wesley Russell. I'm a radiation oncologist with Radiation Oncology Associates, and I work at Parkview Cancer Institute, uh, and I'm a board member on Cancer Services. I'm really proud to be working with Cancer Services and, and to have the opportunity to serve on the board. Um, I know how much they do for our patients. Um, I know what they mean to this community, um, and I know how important their mission is. Um, so that's just something I'm very proud to be associated with. There are many opportunities to volunteer at Cancer Services of Northeast Indiana. You can volunteer on your own or with a group of friends, and you can rest assured that your efforts will directly help families with cancer in your local community. My husband passed away 19 going on 20 years ago. He had four different kinds of cancers in nine years and towards the end he was at home in a hospital bed. We were fortunate to keep him there. We used the cancer bed pads. When he passed I always thought, oh, somehow there was an opportunity to give back what we were given and I went to Northeast Indiana Cancer Services and they suggested something like that. Uh, there are so many positions and options out there where a person can give of yourself. Cancer Services is one of them. I've had cancer hit close to home a couple different times. My brother passed away at cancer, from cancer at a young age. 30 um, so that was a difficult time for me and then my brother-in-law just a few years ago uh, had a brain tumor that was cancerous and uh, so he had to go through chemotherapy and radiation and um, all that that brings and the difficulties that come with that so cancer is definitely something that hits close to home for for my wife and I uh, which is a lot of the reason that we like to give back by volunteering for cancer services. My brother was 27 when he was diagnosed with colon, stage four colon cancer, and that was kind of my introduction to cancer services. He asked me to just to stop by and and uh, pick up shakes for him after work, um, since I lived down in Bluffton. When my brother passed away in uh, 2010, I decided I wanted to even do further volunteer. And so that's when I joined the board back in 2013 when he passed away. Almost every board meeting I come in, I think of him, you know, and just the the battle that he went through and his family when they were fighting cancer and the impact that it made and uh, just how cancer services can come alongside people like that and help them through it. Volunteer opportunities include helping clients get to treatment appointments, preparing, inspecting, or sewing bed pads, representing cancer services at health fairs and community events, assisting with administrative tasks, and serving on one of several committees. To learn more about volunteering, submit an application online at www.cancer-services.org or call us at 260-484-9560.